Hunters, health officials, and wildlife managers are working to get a better handle on how many deer are on Martha's Vineyard and Nantucket, including estimates from harvest numbers and an aerial survey of the islands a year ago. While hunters contend the estimates of 50 or more deer per square mile are high, everyone agrees there are a lot of deer on the islands. The problem with too many deer, according to health officials and researchers, is that they feed bloodthirsty ticks and help spread Lyme disease and other tick-borne illnesses. This is going to be a sweet spot. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, you can't really see so much with all the snow down, but if you walk up and down, there's just huge tracks everywhere. Really? But attempts to thin the herds face significant obstacles, including opposition to hunting, lack of hunter access to private lands, and a lack of predation on the islands. An additional period of hunting, which was tried on Nantucket in February 2005, although successful in reducing the number of deer, caused conflicts between off-island hunters and locals. State and local officials are now trying to make it easier for hunters to harvest more deer and trying to educate the public on the danger of tick-borne diseases. Hunters on Nantucket often give away venison to their neighbors, and the hunting is an important source of food for many families, according to Nantucket Fire Captain Matt Dixon, who volunteers to check in deer shot by hunters. Yeah, yeah. But health officials say more needs to be done, and the densities of deer on the islands will need to be reduced to 10 per square mile to affect the high incidence of tick-borne diseases.